It's been a while. Um, it's been more than a minute. <laughs> I might look a little different. We've got a new set here. This is a virtual background. No surprise there. Uh, the set is under construction. So here's what happened. Where have I been the last couple of years? Very busy. My professional life has kind of taken over in unexpected ways. And uh, I stepped away for an interesting new opportunity. Making videos was just not an option anymore. Something had to fall off, but I missed it. I missed creating. I missed the process. I missed the editing. I missed teaching and sharing. I needed to get back to this. I needed to get back to creating content, sharing and teaching, which is something I love so much. What are the barriers to entry? Why do I not create content as often as I want to? And there's a lot of factors. What's going on with work? What's going on at home? And some of those specific things are tough to really adjust, to slide up or down. There's also a third factor, and that is, how long does it take for me to set up to record a video and get into that space where I'm editing and creating and ultimately delivering content to you? One of those challenges has always been using my existing office space as a set. The engineer in me wants everything. I want lights, cameras, and sound. I want all these things. So ultimately I realized I had to skinny that back a bit and say, I can create good content if I make a couple of compromises versus great content that I never create because it takes so long to set up, tune, record, and get going. We have an extra guest room. If you have a guest room, you know how often you have guests in that room. Like what, twice a year, like two nights a year? Come on, it's not a lot. At least that's my case. Maybe you're different. Maybe you have guests all the time. You're way more popular than I am. <laughs> it's this void space in our home. You can make that space flexible and build out a Murphy bed. The bed folds up against the wall. Now you've got this big open space that you can use for something on the other 363 days out of the year when it's not occupied by guests. And I love projects, so that was right up my alley. I don't actually need a lot of space. I need a desk, I need a place for a camera, I need suitable light and light control in the room. And it's really, really helpful if it's dedicated to that. I can pop in here and record a video real quick. I don't have to reconfigure my office because that's very disruptive for work. I can't do that. It's also a lot more space than I even need. It's a reasonable sized room. My wife also is a very creative person. It made a lot of sense for us to take this room and not just for me to take it over, over, but for this to be a creative space for, for both of us. So she has an area in this room and I have a space where I can create content. We coexist in this space and she's not actually here, but it, it seemed like it would be fun to wave as if she was off camera. She's not actually here. She has space to work her creative outlets and I have one for mine. Long story short, a lot of inside baseball there, but what does this really mean at the end of the day? I'm back and I'm creating content again, and I love that. So I've got a whole new content series here for you as well. An area I'm gonna focus on real deeply as a good introduction and reintroduction to my channel is home automation. It's an area of technology that has been near and dear to me for the better part of two decades. It's something I'm really passionate about. We're gonna start with some base topics and we're gonna move on through. For those of you that are home automation enthusiasts, you know that that feeds down a lot of rabbit holes. So we're gonna be deep into the IoT world. We're gonna be in C++ building circuit boards. We're gonna be in 3D printing, graphic design and UI design and workflow. All the wonderful things that home automation and the integration of those parts tap into. So please join me in this. Thank you for everybody that has stuck with me through this dry spell when you get back into it. So look for that next video. It's coming very soon. Please like and subscribe. Hit the notification bell. So you see when that next video comes, it's coming real soon. Thanks everybody, I'll see you soon.